What's this little thing up here? What does that say? Tune? What happens when I do it? No way. No way. 705 doesn't have a built-in tuner. Oh, but wait. We've tricked you. We've got the LDG Z100 Plus tuner plugged into the 705 and it is fully integratable. This is probably one of the more affordable auto tuners you can get that automatically integrates with the 705. Let's see if we can go somewhere where it's not so perfect. This is not an 80 meter antenna and let's see what happens. What's really interesting on this is that the SWR was perfect before, so I'm wondering if this tuner is presenting a perfect match to the radio and then suffering the consequences of a mismatch on its own. I think we're out of tune now, so let's get a key and see how badly out of tune we are. Hang on. All right, we have a 3D printed key in hand. Yeah, so SWR is off the charts. Let's put the tuner in line. I think it couldn't find a match. Yep, can't find a match on that band. Let's try something that's worse, maybe? <laughs> that's funny. It's happy on 160, but not happy on 35. All right, let's switch over to, I don't know, somewhere else. But, well, let's go back to 80 meters. Let's get higher in the band on 80 meters. Right at the top of the band there. Yeah, I think there's got to be some kind of protection built in where the tuner just kind of takes one for the team. I like that. Oh, look at that. So it'll tune high end of 80, but not low end of 80. Let's go back down the bottom. Rock bottom. And I'm out of match, so it automatically kicks in the tuner when I key down. And did not find a match. Yeah, I can't find a match on the low end of 80. Interesting. But that's the way tuning works. That's the... That's the crux of the matter. Let's go up here, top of the band. I don't hear anybody. Let's try it. And then right when I said I didn't hear anybody, somebody started talking. All right, we got a match. Yep. So you can see here, it says one, and then the, well, let me turn the meter off for you. It says one, and then the next one is 1.5, and then two, and we are below. We're on the lower side of half between one and 1.5. I think that's like 1.2. I think that's fantastic. So solid player. Let me show you how this thing gets hooked up because it's actually really straightforward. There's zero configuration settings, but over here on the side of the 705, you take a standard audio cable. This is tip ring sleeve. And then there are two jacks on the top. The first one is send ALC and the second one is tuner. And when you put it in, it checks in with the tuner and says, hey, are you a tuner? And the tuner says, I sure am. And then you can go into function menu and it's on page two, and there it is. And we are in tune. Perfect, and we actually got a better tune this time. That's all there is to it. This is a great match. It doesn't weigh hardly anything. It doesn't look bad up next to the 705. This amp is also a great match. And there is another video that I have on working with this amp with this radio. All of this is a, is a good bit of kit to have in your home shack. And then these two are good for travel. And I did a review on the Elecraft T1 tuner also. That's another fantastic match for this radio, but it doesn't have this automatic interface out of the box. I think there's a way where it can be done, but I'm not 100% sure. Howdy everybody, Steve here, KM9G. That was a quick walk around the dial with the LDG Z100, the Z100 Plus Auto Tuner. This tuner is good for up to 120 watts, I believe. Let me check that real quick. Oh, I was close. It's 125 watts on SSB and CW and 30 watts on PSK and digital modes. That's interesting that they say that CW is 125 watts also. I guess it's the, the quick on and off that it's fine with, but it's not the, the full key down for 15 seconds like FT8 does that it, that it uh, can't handle. But it works out really well and it's fantastic for a portable tuner because it has latching and relays and there's room inside for some AA batteries. I have shown you inside of tuners before, so I won't show you inside of this one. I just wanted to share with you how well this thing works with the 
IC705. I think this is a good match. I think the Elecraft T1 is probably a better match, but those things are unobtainium. This is a fantastic price. It's a good package. There are links in the description down below, and there's a video right here I think you will enjoy next. Thanks for being awesome. I'll see you over there.